Hello, and welcome to RQB Testimonials. My name is Adam Rondo. Here we'll be speaking with business owners just like yourself about their experience with remote quality bookkeeping. Now, mind you, these endorsements are not paid for, nor are they scripted. These are just real business owners, much like yourself, who love the experienced and knowledgeable staff at Remote Quality Bookkeeping and all that they've done for their business's bookkeeping needs. So, with that being said, let's begin. Joining us today is Mark Kildup, owner, CEO, I think, or CFO. You're three letters with Remote Quality Bookkeeping. I don't know which ones. You're one of them, though. Mark, welcome aboard your own testimonial show. Uh, thank you. <laughs> so I figured if we're going to if we're gonna have your clients and your the people that use your service talk about you and your business, we might as well meet you, the person behind it, so everyone can know who Mark and Remote Quality Bookkeeping are. So I'm thinking, Mark, just a little bit about yourself and how you got Remote Quality Bookkeeping started. Well, in this arena, there's a lot of people right now, but... Back in the day, I was uh, one of the very first to do this. Um, yes, because was, remote, well, you guys are, sorry to interrupt, but you're, you're cloud-based. And I, I think that people really got to know that right off the bat. You're not, right. you're not the, I have to meet you in person kind of business. That's right. It started as a you know, roving uh, service. I would show up at your door and, uh, and you know, perform the tasks at hand. But uh, now with technology, and I think it was 2006 when that really turned the corner for me, um, and started hosting people's data, giving them access to it. And now everything we do for the client is a la carte. So it's as much or as little as they want. Now, today's environment, they want to do it a certain way and they try to get you into a cookie cutter approach. But RQB is very tailored, very uh, flexible, and uh, we'll do as much or as little as you'd like, uh, leaving you in the, you know, in the seat uh, to control your company or you know, relinquish it if it just frustrates you and you're always spending way too much time doing the accounting. Yeah, I think that's kind of the part that um, I think the benefit of business owner right now, especially the most, is that those that are kind of up and coming even, those those ones that think like, oh, maybe I, I can't afford a bookkeeper, I can't afford this kind of service, it seems too expensive. It really isn't because there's no overhead. All, all you do is have a server and all the data is stored on that. And like you said, you can pick and choose what little things you want. So even if you only want them to do some of it, you can, you can alleviate some of that stress from the business owner. And that way they can still have some of the basic stuff to do, but leave all those weird technical numbers to you, the people that actually know what they're doing. Okay. Um, and this also means that for uh, a business owner, like if myself, I wouldn't have to, I don't have any employees. I don't have any payroll because you're, you're not my employee. You're just a service that I contract out. So I feel like that's also a big saver uh, for local businesses. That's right. You can hire us to be a help desk, which means we'll, you know, be there. We have some larger clients that have 30 to 60 employees and they have someone on site doing the bookkeeping, but there's a lot of challenges that come down the pipe, especially relating to union uh, insurances, audits. So we're a help desk to them. Uh, and, you know, we tap in when they need us, tap out when they don't. Uh, and then there are other companies that, you know, they just would rather us do everything that they look at it from a report standpoint, uh, you know, a summary review of what was done. Well, I think that's the thing that you kind of said too there is that it's, it is an added expense if you think about it to have you guys, but certainly nowhere near as much as it would probably cost to actually hire an in-house bookkeeper. Plus again, all the taxes, the insurances you got to put in the employee now, there's all these additional costs to having your own in-house accountant when with you guys, again, it's none of that. I pay you, I write you a check every month and I go, here you go, make the numbers work and all of a sudden they're done. Yeah, and in this world, everything's changing on a day-to-day -day basis. So it's good to have somebody that's up on those changes to, to guide you. Yeah, and you have a whole staff too. It's not just you doing all the work. So, I mean, you guys are constantly going through training and, and learning all that new stuff that you were talking about, which right. is exactly why I would use you because I don't have the brain to figure out numbers and math and all that stuff. So that's why I hire you because I know that you're going to know exactly what's going on. When you say, Adam, we need form 642B. I'm like, you, I don't know, print it. I don't want it. That's you sign away. And I just trust you. Um, but I think that's the great thing. And I mean, like you said, technology, today, it, it's so, it's so easy and so helpful, but it's also very secure because I feel like that might be one of the bigger concerns for business owners is, you know, can they trust remote quality bookkeeping to keep their data safe on the cloud? Right. So a little bit about my staff that lends to the trustworthy uh, aspect. Um, so I have associates that deal with the payroll uh, on 
payroll in, in, in my company. Um, I have associates that do strictly banking. So they'll log into all the clients starting on Monday and you know as long as it takes each associate to get through their list of clients to basically synchronize everything that's happened to them in real life back into the accounting so that as the client logs in, they're able to see what has happened uh, as early as a week, you know, uh, you know, if, if this week is going on, today's Tuesday, by Monday, they'll have that all captured and so that they can make sense of it right down to within a week. Um, so I have associates that do banking, some that do payroll, uh, others that do troubleshooting. Uh, I do the onboarding and sales, you know, getting everything acclimated for the client, I mean, for the staff. Um, and so with my staff, I found it a long time ago easily uh, to find good quality uh, people that understand accounting in the part-time world. Um, there's a lot of MBA moms that would love to go back to work but don't have the fortitude to spend 40 hours a week plus traveling and everything that would be committing to a you know, full-time job. And so these part-time MBA moms love doing the work they do for us, for you, and then you know, they're able to, you know, cut out when they need to, to take care of, you know, the kids, pick them up at the bus, drop them off at camp, whatever it is, uh, and still be able to give me what I need to give you. Um, and so we're also in very close with a, a college in this state that has an, uh, uh, an internship program uh, so that we get some very bright talent um, from, from Stonehill College. Uh, and it's a college that if you're in this area, you want to be a CPA, that's the, the premier college to go to. So we get a lot of good talent and it's cost effective because you don't have to hire them, you know, 40 hours a week. We can, you know, get their talent when they can give it to us. It just means more part-time people than, you know, having two or three full-time people. So it really works out well. Yeah, it sounds excellent knowing that you employ, you know, local people and give those college kids kind of their start in what I'm assuming is a pretty challenging and demanding business. Um, and like we were talking about earlier with the cloud, uh, those that go with remote quality bookkeeping, they can be assured that their data is going to be safe, correct? I mean, the cloud is, it, it's as safe, if not safer than them storing it locally themselves. That's right. We store it on the, uh, uh, on the cloud in two different parts of the nation. But then we also have an internal backup system that goes every night at 2 a.m. So it's backed up three different ways, two different ways in three different parts of the nation. Um, and I've had to restore data that's gone corrupt. You know, a person's, you know, file gets so big that uh, it corrupts, you know, started to act funny. So we just backed it up from the day prior, started to repair it and, you know, got out of a situation that uh, could have developed into being a worse situation if we hadn't had those backups. And I can go back up 30 days. Uh, and pull a file from 30 days ago. So yeah, we're very confident that we're safe and secure. Uh, we spent a lot of money with an IT company to make sure that we're hacker free. Uh, we've put in uh, safeguards, uh, you know, just to prevent anything from coming down the pipe. As, as we are a good resource for companies, you know, when it comes to learning the cutting edge changes of the laws, we have a IT company that does the same thing in, in the security aspect. So they called me one day and said, we got to have a meeting, you know, we're going to have a webinar and, and teach you all of you what's coming down the pipe. Um, so, you know, they showed us what was happening to some other companies that they're working with. And, you know, that motivated all of us enough as clients to take the extra steps that they were suggesting just to be that much more safer. Um, so yes, we do have a good, uh, approach to security and, uh, and, and, you know, effectiveness and backups. Excellent. And I think that's really one of the bigger reassuring points uh, of remote quality bookkeeping. Again, the, the well-trained and talented staff, the, the delightful owner of the company. Uh, it's, it's great to see that, that there is something out there that I think would be good for any size business, you know, whether it be new to massive, you guys can handle it. Uh, and you know, you know your stuff. And again, your data is secure. And as a business owner, you have access to it anytime you want. Um, even if it's 3.30 in the morning, you log in and there's all your data. And like Mark said, you can see it uh, up to date in real time. Um, so it's, it's really just a, an all-inclusive 
a la carte system uh, for every business owner out there. So Mark, I thank you very much for coming on, uh, explaining what you do, who you are. Uh, so that way everyone that sees these uh, videos after this can at least kind of put the, the face to the name that we're going to be saying uh, ad nauseum in some of these videos. <laughs> All right, awesome. Thank you, Mark.